Hello everybody, this is yours truly, and this is the projector that was made possible for that for those uh, segments of gameplay that I was trying to do off the projector with my phone. This graphics turned horribly up, but yeah. I say horribly because, well, even though it does look pretty nice, I mean, frame rate wise, it's pretty snappy, if I'm going to be honest with you. Even though it is zoomed in a little bit. Okay, there we go. So yeah, basically this is the projector right here that I got for $20. It did the job pretty well, but, but unlike my phone... It wasn't, you know, cutting in and out, kind of like how my phone was when I turned the graphics all the way up on my camera, like, don't get me wrong, the frame rate and all is pretty nice, but after at least like a good six or seven minutes, though, a good chunk of that video, video was, you know, either lost or I don't know what happened to it, like, it should have been around 20 minutes when I actually finished up with those parts of the video, but I can't explain it, but still, I want to show this video anyway because, well... This was that literally me playing Vigor off the projector. I mean, it looked really nice though. I'm not gonna lie. Hello everybody, this is yours truly, and you may be wondering, why are we staring at a wall? Well, the answer is gonna be pretty simple. You see, we're actually gonna be doing another Vigor video, but this one is definitely gonna be a little bit different. What makes this one so different? Well, because the only thing I can say is that we're going to be playing this one off a projector. And the only thing I can say about this is that even though it definitely seems like a, it could be a bad idea, I'm actually interested, I'm actually interested in seeing if it's actually going to work because frankly I just picked up this projector for $20 and it looks promising. That's the only thing I can say really. Very, very promising. And bright. Now since we do have our projector here, our awesome $20 projector, it's time that we fire up our Xbox. So far, we just got our Xbox fired up and everything, so... So, yeah, basically we have Projector, and now we're about to have Vigor. It, yeah. Yeah. Let's do this, everybody. So, we're on the typical Vigor splash screen, like usual. Just so you know that it's actually a Projector. This is me moving the tripod some, and this is actually being displayed off my wall, so, yeah. I'm kind of interested to see exactly how this may turn out, because, after all, I've always wanted to play something off a projector and show it to YouTube, but, Vigor, this might be a first. Now, I have, I am using some speakers so that you guys can also hear as well, but as for me, I'm also going to be using these Turtle Beach Recon 70s that I have for Christmas, so, yeah, that's also going to be pretty fun, and I generally can't wait to see how well this is going to turn out, because it looks crystal clear on this wall, like a movie theater, and you can see that Aurora Borealis there, but, <laughs> yeah, so, no face cam, not like the last video, but we're just doing something crazy, because I've had plans for rifle guides and that kind of stuff, but, yeah. We're gonna work on that. And as Vigor's loading, I'm just gonna go pause the video, so. Now, I know some of you Vigor veterans are probably gonna be wondering. WDZT, have you officially gone mad yet? Answer? Yes, because I ran out of good ideas and went out of projector. <laughs> but yeah. So, yeah, basically the video footage is actually looking pretty nice off my phone, if I'm gonna be honest. And at this rate, I generally think that you guys may be able to hear this. Yeah. So we have Vigor. Official Vigor footage. Yeah. Right off the projector, everybody. Only thing I can say is that even though 
it is coming off the projector and on my wall at the same time. It looks pretty nice, I'm not gonna lie though. It's definitely not something that I would definitely have been expecting, even though it does look like some minor visuals can be a little bit blurry. It can definitely work. But no, I'm literally running this right off my wall, so you gotta bear with me here. This is my first time actually doing a projector gameplay footage, so yeah. Now let's start out by doing a quick game of uh, shootout, shall we? One of Vigor's laggiest anomalies, if I'm gonna be honest with you. Why well, get my other loadouts and everything else ready? I mean, probably should craft it first, but you know. Yeah, just some other friends. I don't know. They need to fix that thing. This thing could definitely be better. Way better. I don't know. This thing's been pretty nice to me. The A74K. So, yeah. While we're waiting on that, I'm gonna go pause until we actually get a round starting. And we are preparing, everybody. Preparing right now. Now let's sit down and enjoy it, shall we? Now I should let you know if you do hear a little bit of some crackling in the background. That's just a projector since even though it is $20 and it's a pretty nice one at best. It was $20 for a reason. Just remember that. Now the speakers that I also have are just usual desktop speakers. Nothing much, but with how the printer is, sorry, without the projector is actually handling things so far, it's going pretty nice. I'm not gonna lie though. Even though I do have the volume turned way up on this thing in the menu, we should probably do something about that. I forgot, since it is a projector after all. Putting out a max volume can actually do some weird stuff to your video quality. I mean, sound quality, but you know. Now let's go. We got ourselves a VZ50AP. I mean, it looks pretty nice. Oh. Alright, I heard someone shooting. This just looks kind of weird since I've never ever played Vigor off a of projector before, but still. Oh, I see them. Nope. Nah. My first kill off the projector in Vigor. At least Sawmill's not looking too bad. No, no, no. I can't even get I can't even get a break in this mode. Now if there's like a way I can turn up the brightness, that'd be pretty cool. Pretty cool indeed. No, there's a guy. Hey, I finally got one! My first kill with a projector. <laughs> Get out of here with that M16, why don't ya? VZ58's where it's at. Where'd this nugget go? I'm just charging right into danger like Mung Doll. Come on! That, that... I thought the VZ58 was supposed to be good. Alright, so yeah, basically this is it right here. Uh, the old sawmill. Vigor's strangest wonder. Gosh darn it. It's staying in one spot, why don't you? Of course, you got an ADR. I should have expected that. But it's these dark areas that I gotta be worried about since... Oh, crap. Dark 
farther and far away targets my kryptonite. Oh crap. MGV for the win. MGV for the win. This gun will always be better than the ADR 97. Don't anybody else tell you otherwise. Uh, there's a way I could do the brightness on this thing. A little bit better. It could be easier. That's the only thing I'm going to say, really. How? Exactly how again. Like I said, this is Vigor's strangest anomaly. This being shootout. And that's my baby. I don't even know how I'm in second place, but I'm just doing it, guys. I'm just doing it. Okay, we got ourselves an AKM. That's good. Now, it's not the speaker that's throwing me off. It's more of the color palette. Like, when it's really dark, it gets a little bit difficult to see other players. And that's a fact. It's an absolute war zone out here in these them their outlands in the Norways and stuff. Oh. Oh, you camper. You camper. You won't win, you camper. But no, seriously though, playing this off of a projector is just it just feels great. I mean it would be a little bit better if I actually had a projector screen screen to say the least. And the brighter color palette, but still. I missed. Oh, crap. Not today. We can't all be headshots. Not all of them. Without any of the changes to like the contrast or anything, just by playing it off in complete darkness. It actually is pretty hard though. And you also got this weirdo with the MG3, but <laughs> I bet you I could use that bullet hole way better than I'm on a TV screen, but still. Finally! And there's this grease kind of weirdo right here. How? Never mind. I probably don't want to question it, otherwise it'll probably rot the brain. And we got some H bar spam right there. I almost thought this guy was a switch player for a sec. Oh, 
There we go. Now by turning up the contrast on this thing, we may be able to have it, our upper edge again. Oh yeah, I can see where he is now. But I couldn't see where that other guy was, so yeah. Basically, all you just gotta do is set up the contrast to where it's actually, you know, slightly brighter on this projector, and I think you'll have the upper edge. Why are you running? Why are you running? Oh, you're up there. Ooh! Just got him with that projector kill. Let's go. Now let's see if I can hunt anybody else down since faraway targets at night on this map are they're kind of a butt to see, but this is my second sporting today. I'm not happy. But yeah, basically the only thing that'll just hold you down is the darkness. Like, if you're surrounded in darkness, it's not a good look for you, even if you're on a projector. That's just coming from me. And you got this guy over here with the, uh... Ooh. Oh boy, you gotta be kidding me. I don't have time for this. Maybe I do. Big picture, man. Let's go. Right, now let's see who's all over there. I think I just saw somebody go flying over there, but I probably don't want to. I probably don't want to question it much. So yeah, the weirdo with the A1 is still over there. Oh crap! Roof camping man guy. Yeah, basically that happened. Also, grow some like guys in this, but I don't, I don't understand why Vigor. But still, that was basically a shootout with a projector.